Hey everybody, um, one of the quick things I want to show you is um, making your own copy if it's shared with you or if you want to share it with other uh, teachers or whoever. Sometimes when we create a document and we want to see it in view only mode, um, we that means we don't really want people to doctor it up as I've said before. Um, but you want people to have their own copy and maybe fill it out and maybe share it back with you. Um, so things aren't too doctored up. Here is a quick way to do that. As you can see, I'm on anybody in the district can see this um, document. I'm going to make sure that link is copied. Again, think about your settings. This is only in the uh, in Aldi, so or in our district. I'm going to open up a new tab, and then I am going to paste that new link. Notice where you see edit. I'm going to highlight edit on down and I'm going to type in just the words copy. C-O-P-Y. Okay. Now what I'm going to do is just for this demonstration, I'm going to copy this link again and I'm going to open up another tab. When I open up the other tab and I paste this link in, there's that link. When I press enter, it is forcing them to make their own copy. So if you click on make a copy, it's gonna show a copy of whatever the title is, whether erosion, and it's only dedicated to that person in the account. It doesn't go out to anybody else. They can do what they wanna do with it. They can um, create uh, uh, the answers back into the assignment and then share it back with whoever they need to share it back to. Another thing that I do want to also share with you is the Google shortener link. Okay, so let's say we're still in this uh, copy link, uh, original icon. I'm going to copy that and I'm going to go to goo.gl, enter. And when I'm there, I'm going to paste that link there and I'm going to click shorten and as you can see this is the shortened link I'm going to click done and when I click done it's going to show up at the top my shortened link goo.gl and then the rest of the um, uh, word, uh, letters in the link there but if I click on these three dots and QR code it's going to give me a QR code for uh, that particular document. So when you go back, you can do one or two things. So you can copy this URL. You can paste that URL into your document. So say if you're doing a presentation and you're doing it on this you're showing it on the screen and you want people to go to a certain link I'm going to make this bigger a little bit bigger and then I'll make it red and then maybe I want to paste that QR code so I'm going to go back to that goo uh, shortener link site I'm going to go to the three dots click on QR code then I'm going to right click and copy that image, go back to my Google Doc and paste that in there. So now what you can do is when you show this in a presentation on a big screen, they can type in the link at the top and they can type in that QR code with the settings that you were given in the that I gave you in the very beginning. So that they won't be the edited version, it will be what they can only view. So that's a quick tip. Thanks a lot, you guys.